Hey guys, so I'm back to filming on my camcorder because I found the connector cord that goes from the camera to the computer. So that's awesome and I just got a text message. Yeah, okay, today I will be filming the what's in my bag video. This is my purse here. It's a little bit full, but that's okay. Um, it is from Amazon. And it's like very similar to the Mulberry Alexa bag, which is about, it's over a thousand dollars, I know that for sure. Um, but this bag is real leather, and I got it for just over a hundred dollars uh, for Christmas. And it looks like this, this cognac leather material, the little clasp, and the buckles, which I absolutely love. And then the handle is kind of braided so you can wear it like on the crook of your arm and you can also carry it crossbody which is what I usually do so let's go into it open it up it looks like this all kinds of stuff in here and there are two slip pockets in the front and then a zipper pocket in the back and then the, just like a whole bunch of space so the first thing is my cell phone. Um, yeah, I just got a text message, so that's cool. <coughs> I have an iPhone 5S, and my case looks like this. I got this from, for Christmas also. Um, I got it on Amazon, actually, but it's by someone that, like an Etsy seller, so it's like customized and everything, but I will leave their link down below. I'm not being sponsored. I got this, like because I was searching for a cute monogrammed phone case and this one caught my eye and I think it's adorable. Um, <clears throat> but I'll leave their link down below so you can check them out. They have really cute stuff. They have like card tags, um, phone cases, mouse pads, that kind of stuff. It's really cute and monogrammed. And this one just has elephants on it and my monogram, of course, and it's like very protective. I might do a, a review on it. Um, but yeah, this is my phone, the black case, and then the, um, yeah, this part. <laughs> but I also have a gingerbread latte. Today is New Year's Day, so Happy New Year, everybody. I hope you all had a safe and happy New Year's Eve. I had a lot of fun. I went to a house party with some of my friends and family. It was pretty awesome. <laughs> but yes, I got a gingerbread latte because I think they only keep selling them for a couple more days or like a week or so after New Year's. I don't remember. But it's so delicious. Mm, yum. <coughs> okay. Let's keep going. I keep like rambling and stuff. Probably gonna have to edit this some. Yeah. <laughs> then I just have my keys. You know, basic. I have a AAA card, Walgreens, CVS, grocery store, and the YMCA because I'm going to get fit this year. <laughs> so yeah, that's my keys. Okay, then I have my wallet. And my wallet is from... Michael Kors, I got this last year, I believe, um, and it looks like this. It's like, it's real leather, I believe, and it's like a plum sort of berry color. And in here, I just keep cards, my cash, ID, you know, and some loose change, and like gift cards and things. So that's my wallet, and I like it because it has a little wristlet, so I can just take this and my keys if I really need to run. Then I have my planner and I got this at Target today and put a monogram sticker on it because who doesn't love monograms? <laughs> and I can't remember where I got my monogram sticker but I know you can uh, find them on Etsy. But So this is my planner. Looks like this. It's gold and really cute. It's from uh, Sugar Paper is the brand. And I am excited to be using this in 2015. I think it's really cute and I like the gold. It's like 
Kate Spade inspired sort of. Then I have another notebook type thing. This is actually my journal. Um, so I write like daily in this and I like to keep it in my bag. This is actually from Kate Spade. I got this mm, a few months ago. And I love everything Kate Spade. It's so, so, so cute. I think this was only $12, which is a little expensive for like a diary journal type thing. But it's so cute, and I couldn't pass it up because it's like pink on the inside, which is awesome. <laughs> and on there, I just keep a pen. This one is from Jonathan Adler, and it's really cute. I like the pattern on it. The pink and orange is really cute. So I just clip that on there. Then I just have some Altoids. These are the Altoids Arctic Curiously, Curiously Cool Mints in Peppermint. Just look like this. They're yummy. And it fell on the floor. That's totally fine. Oh, it keeps sliding off my lap. Then I have my sunglasses in this coach case. And they're by coach also. And they look like this. I think they're pretty cute. I really like my sunglasses. I like how they're big. I think they fit my face and I I just like the style a lot. And they have like the C's here for coach. It's really cute. But I have them prescription. They're like prescription lenses because I am blind as a bat and that's why I wear glasses. Then I have my little makeup bag. Um, this I think it's from China actually. Um, my godparents uh, adopted two kids from China and they brought this back, uh, this little bag back for me. And I think it's really cute. It's like a satiny, silky material. So in here, I keep some bobby pins, excuse me, with a little hair tie around them, a Blistex medicated lip balm. I love these. These are so awesome. Highly recommend. A lip gloss from Butter London. This is one of their lippy lip glosses in the shade Secret Door. I got this at TJ Maxx and it's just like a pinky color. It comes out pretty sheer on your lips, but it's just nice and it's moisturizing and it's a pretty color. And I don't think I have anything on my lips now, so I'm going to put some on. Yeah, it just gives you a little bit of color and some shine. Then I have my Travelo Little Perfume atomizer I think that's how you call it or what it's called and um, in here I just have Taylor Swift Wonderstruck which is kind of like a fruity fresh sort of scent and I like keeping this in my bag and I have my all-time favorite hand cream this is from Bath and Body Works the True Blue Mini paraffin uh, super softening hand lotion and I seriously love these. It smells really good and keeps your hands and your cuticles and your elbows or wherever else you need moisturized really nicely and it's it's really awesome. I like the formula a lot. Then I just have some Advil in this little thingamajig here. Yeah, the packaging's really worn because I just reused a little bottle. Um, but you never know when you're going to get a headache or cramps. That's also why I have tampons in the back pocket of my purse. Yeah. Then I have a few makeup items. I have a mascara from NYX. This is the Le Chick Vic uh, Waterproof Mascara. And it's just a nice mascara for touch-ups and things. <clears throat> and I have an eyeliner. This is from Jordana. They're easy liner for eyes in lavish brown. It's just a nice like deep dark brown. I like that a lot. 
I have a concealer, an under eye concealer, because I have really bad dark circles, I think. <clears throat> and this is actually a corrector from Bobbi Brown. And it's in Light Bisque. And it just looks like this. And it has a little mirror too, which is nice. I've used quite a bit of this. I used up a whole entire one in 2013. So I got this sometime like May or so, 2014. So I'm doing pretty good. It's lasted quite a while. And the last thing I have in my little makeup bag is another lip treatment kind of thing. This is from Fresh. This is their Sugar Rose Tinted Lip Treatment. And it's just like a balm that smells like lemons. It smells so good. These are like super expensive full size. I got this as a birthday gift, I think. Um, but normally they retail, the like large size retails for like $22.50 or something. Uh, but it just looks like this. It's just a nice like rosy balm to put on to give you a bit of color and a ton of moisture. These are so awesome. So I fail. <laughs> um, so that is everything that is in my purse. I hope you all enjoyed this. I will link my purse down below as well as where I got my phone case. Um, and hopefully I will be doing more videos soon. I'm really enjoying this and I'm glad to be back. I wish you all a happy and healthy 2015. Bye!